Hello out there in YouTube land. This is my second account. I'm going with Tome Time on this. It's going to be all about books. I have all my other, my other channel for comics and TV shows and movies and stuff. This one I'm just going to go entirely with books. And my inaugural video will be about one of my favorite series ever, Robert B. Parker's Spencer series. Now, for those of you who don't know uh, the Spencer series, it is a series that came out in I think it's 1972. The first book was, and if I remember correctly, it was yep, the Godwin one and the script. Not of the Judas Note. No, yeah, it was the God Wolf Man manuscript. This introduced a character by the name of Spencer. And if you see here, it is S B E N S E R. Uh, he is a former soldier. He fought in Korea, which is how all the characters at this point. Uh, ex boxer, ex cop. Now he's a private detective. And this character is a little different because not only is he a professional thug, as he calls it, a PI gumshoe, he cooks. And so they, Robert B. Parker spent a lot of time you know, putting, describing the creations that he'd cook. And you only know this character by name of Spencer. They don't give a, I'm thinking it's his surname, but they don't give a, a first name. Even his longtime true love, Susan, calls him Spencer. And so they've got a three central characters, you know, maybe the two. There is Spencer and uh, Susan, his girlfriend, which is introduced meets him at the second book. Then there's a guy by the name of Hawk, who they have in a lot of the books, who is uh, if you watched a show in the 80s called Spencer for Hire, that was pretty much these books. They've got you know, uh, the police commissioner and the police detective that they he helps and stuff that he goes to for help. And uh, a few years ago, Robert B. Parker died in true authorly fashion at his keyboard. And so his book series is being continued by a man by the name of Ace Atkins. Now this book here, this is called Slow Burn. This is the latest one which came out last Tuesday. This one is, there is a series of Fire has been set throughout the city, and a old an old friend of Spencer's, who is a a fireman, thinks they're arson, and he comes to Spencer to look into it. And of course, he you know, meets resistance and runs through all the nefarious people that he has to deal with, and this. Isn't one of the more spectacular Spencer books, nor is it the worst. It's a good read, fun to get to, fun to uh, fun to read. The only thing I have, have in there is they've got you know who is doing it and why. I'm not a big fan of that type of mystery. I like trying to figure stuff out as I go. And so you're kind of reading, trying to wait for the shuffle character to catch up. And that I don't like. I like being in the dark, just like the central character, just like Spencer or whoever the hero is, and trying to figure it out as, as they go along as well. But it was a good book. If you want a, you know, a good mystery series to read, 
especially if you want to uh, uh, if you want to have plenty of books to read to catch up, get the Spencer books. There's these all right here are the Spencer ones. Then he's got Jesse Stone and a couple of other some Westerns. So these are some very fantastic so fantastic series. And uh, this one I suggest you can use this one to as your initial book. entertaining and uh, I recommend reading it. Alright, thanks. Subscribe and like. Bye.